Is there a closing time? I want you to be the one to take me home. Apparently not. 12.59 is perfectly acceptable. I'm sorry, I'm not a, I'm not a, I'm not a manly man, I'm not a cool dude anymore. I'm not a little girl. All right, guys, welcome back to Let's Play Rune Factor 2, a fantasy ever smooth. We're just waking up, it's a Thursday morning. And I figure we should take care of our crops first thing in the morning. Give me just a moment. Alright. 117 spots later and I'm not even done yet. <laughs> Oops. But, it's time to get to school, so let's do that. We'll take care of the rest of this later. Listen carefully, be sure to take notes, this will all be on the test. Alright. Let's make a new page for Thursday. Alright, starting off with desserts. First we'll learn how to make a cake today. Let's start by making the batter. First we'll use butter. Next, add small milk. Finally, add flour. Mix all three together to make the batter. Making the batter can be tough, but give it your best shot. You want to decorate your cake when it's done, so add a strawberry. It also looks cute if you use a pink cat on top of it. There, now it's finished. Let's make a cheesecake next. Let's start with the batter. First, you'll need flour. Then add a small egg. Mix them together well. Let's add some small cheese too. Then, bake it in the oven. Spread a crushed cookie on top of it after it's done baking, and it will taste even better. Uh, cookie. Did you understand? The next recipe is chocolate cake. It's very similar to the last recipe. We'll start again with the batter. First, the butter. Then, add small milk. Finally, add flour, and the butter is complete. The batter is complete. Uh, flour. After it's cooked, cover it with a chocolate and it's finished. Next is pudding. First, crack a small egg and beat it. Just beat it. Then add boiled small milk a little at a time. After that's done, put it in the steamer. When it's done steaming, add honey and let it cool. Did you understand? Lastly, we have ice cream. This is a special recipe, so listen carefully. First, heat some small milk. When it gets hot, mix in some honey. The last ingredient is a bit tricky to make. Use an ice staff to cool it off quickly. Uh, there it is. All right, so that's number one. How about number two? Let's begin the class. Cooking secrets. Today we're going to learn how to make some condiments. Let's start with ketchup. Start with the tomato. Then add an onion. You can use add it as is, but it's a good idea to chop it up a bit. Then blend them both together in a mixer. Voila! You're done. You're done. Next up is butter. This is used in many recipes, so don't forget it. Simply put a small milk in the mixer and blend. Let it cool, and it's done. Next, let's try strawberry jam. It tastes great on toast, so let's give it a try. To make it, simmer some strawberry in a pot on low heat until syrupy. Next up is apple jam. It's made the same way. Slowly simmer some apples in a pot. Make sure the heat isn't too high. Lastly, we'll try grape jam. Now you'll be able to make all kinds of jam. Simply simmer some grapes on low heat until they're syrupy. Pretty simple. Alright, let's say hello to everyone. Morning. Morning? What do you want? There's nothing going on here. Nothing fun to see. Morning. Have you heard of pizza? I really love it. Morning. Morning. Why does everyone think I'm a girl? Yep. Same old, same old. The usual stuff. 
give me one moment to look up their stuff, because I have everything in here. Oil Wolf Master, put them in a school. Oil Wolf Master, put them in a school. Oil Wolf Master, put them in a school. So I just checked, and sure enough, I can make or even get anything that any of them like right now. So unfortunate. Alright, back to water. Uh, energy first, then water. Energize! One thing I should mention is I've been going through and cleaning up anything that I think is valuable in any way, whether it's for crafting or just for eating. And just kind of picking it up. That way more things can spawn every day. It takes time, but it doesn't really take much, you know, other than that. Alright, now we enter the dojo. Oh, it's you, Ar Oh, it's you, Aria. Hello, Barret. This is a special place. You can summon monsters here. Really? Why? I don't know for sure. You just can. Oh. And the summoned monster won't be able to leave from here. Oh. And the summoned monster won't be able to leave from here. It's safer than you'd think. Really? And since we have a room like this, you might as well use it for your training. What kind of training? It's simple. Just defeat summoned monsters, one after the other. Isn't that dangerous? This place isn't like a dungeon. If you fate here, you'll be taken to the clinic. Besides, I'll be here with you. Oh. Do you want to try it out? I'll give you something nice if you win. Um, maybe later. We don't even have a weapon currently. Well, you can take the challenge anytime. Come back whenever you'd like. Yes, sir. I'll be back. So that is what this is. It is a dungeon challenge training thing. And we cannot do it yet. Mainly because I don't have a weapon. And I refuse to go get one off principle. <laughs> Out of principle. Ooh, actually, I want all this stuff. Mine. Alright, we're done here for now. Hey, Mom. Good morning, Arya. Arya, study hard. Yeah, okay. Morning. Morning, Arya. I have a feeling that something very important is written on this tablet. I'm gonna see if I can find anything out. This tablet looks like it's only part of one part of the whole. I think there must be more pieces to find yet. Alright, why? Well, better find the rest of the pieces of the tablet then. For now, though. Let's keep to actually doing things, and questing is the thing! Oh, hey, Julia. Good morning, Arya. You're a lively thing, just like your daddy, but don't get too crazy. Okay. Hi, Prep Mr. Roy, I'd want to borrow something. Could you give it to him for me? Lee and Owl. Heck yeah. I have a favor to ask you, Arya. Do you think maybe you could help me out? Sure, no problem. What sort of favor? Great, okay, I want you to give these giant's gloves to Roy for me. I promised to let Roy borrow them a while back, but I totally forgot about it. So, can you do it? Of course! Receive the giant's gloves. Give me one second. You know, I have no idea if this can be used for crafting or not. It probably not. If you can't sell these items, you probably can't craft with them. I'm still interested. I wish I could test it. If... If I get a quest like this in the future, I'll give it a shot. I'm just not gonna wait an entire week for, you know, to do this. Oh, there you are, Roy. Phasing into people. Roy. Did they just teleport? Yeah, considering everyone else is almost here now, I get- yeah, they just warped. They're using the Chaos Emeralds to warp! Come on, man. Giant's gloves. What's this for? What's this for, Arya? Leonel asked me to give them to you. You're gonna borrow them from him, right? Hell yeah, that's right! I'd completely forgotten! Thanks! Be sure to think we an elf thing for me, okay? Hey there. hey there, Arya! Your dad can do it- Okay, it's always the same text. I've brought your lunch. 
Yay, what do we get today? Today you're having the ultimate curry. Oh, okay. Th what? That's a great item. Yes. See you tomorrow. Okay, just get... Is this... I want to say that's like level 70 or something to make. I think that's or level 90? I think Royal Curry might be the level 70 and then Ultimate Curry might be 90. I'm gonna check this in this game. <sighs> no, I'm sorry, I'm wrong. Royal Curry is level 99 in this game. Ultimate Curry is level 95. Th okay, this is fine. This is fine, I guess. Just give me a great item. I'm not complaining, I'm just confused. Ultimate Curry, the product of years of seeking the ultimate curry. Perfect in fragrance, flavor, and appearance. Worth 3,000. Royal Curry is worth even more, I think like 4,800 or something. We, we've seen it before. Uh, it's still a ridiculously good item. Is it anyone's favorite item? I don't have it listed as anyone's favorite item or anything. Um, I guess I'll ship it. That way it's on the ship list. I, I, I guess I'll ship it. Theoretically, we should just ship it when we make it. I'm just, from now on, I'm just going to keep the food I get. I'm thinking about it, unless there are, like, repeats or anything, like... Let's be reasonable. We're gonna need food, so might as well see if it's actually good. Mayor's house first floor. Oh, yeah, Barrett's house. That makes sense. I don't know why I assumed the church. Also, what are you doing here? Good afternoon. You're gonna hang out with your mom today, Aria? No, not once. I'll be sure to give Mana a bunch of gifts later, but for now, no. You did it. Thanks. Here's something for your trouble. Toy herb seed. You're a lifesaver. Thanks, Arya. Thanks, you're a lifesaver, Tee. Awesome. We made a child happy. Not that we aren't a child ourselves. I have, I have something to give Roy! I finished making something for Roy! Give it to him for me! Hi, Arya! I've got a favor to ask of you! What is it, Gordon? Could you give this to Roy? A courage badge. Roy asked me to make him one of these. I've just finished it. Sure thing. I'll give it to him. Thanks. All right, I'm counting on you, Arya. Yes, sir. Um, is that what I think it is? Courage badge. Only given to and worn by those with true courage. Raises various status. Oh. Uh, huh. One more attack and defense, five more magic attack, two more magic defense, and then, of course, raising strength, vitality, and intelligence. Not bad. Not bad. And worth 2,700. It doesn't raise your defense, but it raises all your stats, so... The Courage Badge. Hey, a Courage Badge! What's this? Hey, a Courage Badge! What's this for, Arya? Gordon asked me to give it to you. Oh, that's right. I asked him for one of these a few days ago. Thanks! Wow, this is just great. Be sure to thank Gordon for me. <laughs> Be sure to thank Gordon for me, okay? I want a lesson. Time to start class. Today, today let's start out with a flame saber. First, you'll be needing a claymore. Uh, yes. You should make the blade out of iron. Next, you'll use a fire crystal to give it some firepower. Then, make the guard using a scorpion pincher. You'll use a plant stem to make the grip. After that, wrap it in cheap cloth and you're done. Now, the cycle of the blade. This one's thinner than the others. The first thing you'll need is a claymore. Use iron to hammer that out till it's nice and thin. Use a wind crystal for the blade too. Then
and you'll need a hardened root to make the handle. I don't worry for a ball, so it won't be too difficult to carry. Then make a guard with the tortoise shell. Next is the great sword. It's well balanced and easy to use. This sword is made using a Zvi Hunter, so you'll need one. Next is a spore. Combine that with a plant stab and really sharpen the blade. Uh, yeah. Make it easy to hold by putting a speckled skin on the handle. Uses sparkle string also. Wrap it tight and make sure you don't leave any gaps. This will make it easier to hold on to. Make sure to use a cheap cloth for the foundation. Now for the two-handed earth shade. First, you'll need a claymore. Add an earth crystal to help give it its bizarre shape. Then move to the handle. Start with a spore. Next, you'll need to add a hardened root. Then finish the handle by adding a plant stem. After that, you just have to add a guard. Use insect skin. Last is the sea cutter, a sword with the power of water. First up, you'll need a claymore. Um, then add a water crystal. It'll be fragile, so be careful. After that, add a magic crystal. If you do it right, the sword will always look like it's wet. You'll need a speckled skin to make the grip. Wrap it with a sparkle string, too. Then use a tortoise shell to make the guard and you'll be done. Alright. One more lesson. Time to start class. Eastern Weapons Katana. Today I'm going to teach you how to make the legendary katana. You'll need a great sword, so go make one ahead of time. Then add silver. Pay attention when making the blade. Uh, yeah. Use a fish fossil to make the handle. You also need to use a shoulder piece. It's very important to support the blade, so you'd better not forget about it. Join those two things with glue. Next, use a little crystal to connect the handle to the blade. What do you think? Next is the Dancing Dicer, a sturdy and sharp weapon. First, you'll need a katana, another two-handed sword. Add Panther Claw to the blade as you reforge it. Also, get a hard horn ready to make the handle. You can use a scorpion tail to join the handle to the blade. Make yourself a guard from an arrowhead. Then just wrap a quality cloth around the grip to finish. Next is the bull-eyed blade, a sword whose blade will never falter. First you'll need the dancing dicer we talked about before. Add Giant's Fingernail to the blade as you reforge it. Once again, you'll need a Scorpion Tail to form the joint. Use a Panther Claw to make the handle. Do it quickly. Then use a Strong Bind to harden even more. Then wrap it with a Strong Stream so it'll be easy to carry. Next, I'll teach you to make a moon shadow. Here's what you'll need. Start with a bull-eyed blade. Use a wolf fang to sharpen the blade. Add a bullhorn to make sure it won't bend or anything. You should use a cheap bandage to make the handle. Use glue, too. Then harden it using a little crystal and you'll be done. end today with the Steel Slicer. This one takes skill. First, you'll need a Moon Shadow. Reforge the blade using Platinum. You should add Devil Blood when the blade's cooling. Use a Fish Fossil to make the handle. Also use a Panther Claw when you're making the handle. 
connect the pieces with the wolf fang and you'll be done. And those are actually some really high end weapons. Uh, I believe the last one of those is like a level 95 or 99 weapon or something. So yeah, if you have the skill to use it, it's powerful. Okay, I gave it to Roy, he says thanks. You delivered it for me, thanks! Here, have this! You got 400 G. Thanks again, if I need anything else, I'll be sure to ask you. Thanks, you've been a big help! Trial Ant. Time for training. Come see me, Kay. I figure this will be the last one we do for today. You're starting to make your sword your own? Good, let's push you a little today. I want you to defeat ten ants, okay? Ants are nocturnal, so they'll only come out at night. Watch your back out there. You might just get chomped from behind. Come back to me once you've defeated at least ten ants. Ants live in Trias Forest. Though a nocturnal mean you'll only have to hunt for them once it gets dark. Hey, Arya. School? What's the point? You can't learn how to be a warrior in a classroom. Well, we have a classroom for that. It's called the dojo. I'm a gremlin! <laughs> Alright. Running through the 90s. I'm gonna make a friend by sacrificing my old friend as, uh, something. I don't know. Oh, wow. Uh, there's a... Uh, that wasn't here before, right? I'm in danger. Yeah, okay. Having two enemies? Problematic. Didn't think there were two enemies on the screen. Really wondering where the second one was the last time I was here. Mind you, they know healing spells, so it's, you know, a really good one. Cool. That That's fine. Okay. I just got sniped. Do not teleport behind me. We're trying this. Unfortunate. Well, the bright side is I get to see who says hello again on the screen. Okay, take two. I want a friend. Preferably one that doesn't have magical backup. I went the wrong way. Down here. Okay. Mind you, this is not how you should be doing this. If it could target Sylvie for a moment. <laughs> I know this is dumb, but it is worth to try. <laughs> I swear you'll see what I'm talking about, but like... If Sylvie can stun the gold one... No. I'm 
I'm getting really unlucky with this. And I know this isn't the time to do this. But I want to. I want to have dumb fun with this. What? 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 No, Sylvie! Sylvie! How did you do that? Bad Wolf! And not like Billy Piper, like, no! If I had the Cure Spell already, I... Maybe I should just go after the Cure Spell. That would be smarter. Everybody would be smarter than doing it like this. Also, you know, buying potions would be a good way to do it. Oh, there's a lot of things I could be doing better here. Maybe if I fail this time. Another thing you can do to make this easier is actually buy a upgraded shield. I just got a crap ton of those. I did it! <laughs> I knew it was possible with what I had. It just took some BS. <laughs> Alright. Give me a moment to decide on a name. I had it 100%. Like, yeah. I'm gonna name my new wolf, Cain. This has a few different meanings, such as, like, Canis Lupus and things, and th there's a bunch to it, but just the story of Cain and Abel. That's kind of where I get that from. This is my Cain. Man, if you didn't kick the crap out of me, Cain. I did it! I caught a monster! That was Arya's first monster friend. That's a good feeling. Wait, I could just teleport out. Right. I'm persistent, baby. What can I say? Now, if we go to the second set of fours, B44, four, four, uh, wait. That's... Wasn't I just supposed to add four more? Did it really have this many already? I feel like I'm confused by something. How's it going, Kane? You're looking good today. Let's go. Now. This is Kane. Kane. The Hunter Wolf. It's Daz... It's dazzling fur catches the eye. I feel like a prince riding it. Princess. 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 Definitely princess. How dare you. 125 HP. So if we pet it with... Where... I don't have it on me. Ah! Give me a moment. So Sylvie is level 10 friendship and has 190 HP, right? Sylvia is, of course, the Silver Wolf. Let's see. Are we high enough to raise one? Yes, we are. Kane is up to 142 HP after one pet from us. Each day we'll be raising them him slightly higher and higher. He's already gained 17 HP after one. That means, theoretically, he should have close to 300 HP by the time he's level 10. But I'm not sure about that. We'll see. He should also have a different damage stat than Sylvie. So he is level 1. And... He one-shots these enemies, at least. So that's good.
I'm gonna have to see how he compares to the others, but by level 10, he should stomp a lot of the ones over in Padova. So, I'm gonna spend some time grinding here until night. So, give me a bit. Pretty sure it doesn't respawn, right? Yeah, okay, it doesn't. Cool. Okay. So, spiders, I believe, are the monsters we need to fight. No, it was ants. Okay, wrong screen then. Okay. Ants. Oh, skill up for magic, I guess. Defeated the target monster. Defeated five. Level up. Glad to hear that. I really need to get stronger. So this should be the last one. Yep. I'm gonna drop one of those to then take these drops. So as it is night, we can't turn in our request tonight, but I'm not trying. I was already past the door, but okay, whatever. But if Kane takes us over here, we can go and get a bath. But it's not Julia running the shop anymore. It's now Cammy. Julia has, since becoming a mother, decided that she no longer wants to run the bath shop. Yeah. It's weird considering her entire personality and drives and everything, but it's fine. You want to get in the bath? It costs 100 G, is that okay? Got it. Okay, have it in the bath. Oh, I can't... I almost went to the boys' side. Oh, children, go to sleep. Don't do anything too dangerous, Arya. I should hurry up and go in. Ah, oh, this feels so nice. I guess that's enough for today. Evening. Evening, Arya. You should be out this late. You remind me of your father, Arya. I take that as a compliment. Because if it wasn't a compliment... Mm. And because you're such a good person... Thanks. This is a nice gift. Thanks. I might be able to use this for my next lesson. Better than the first generation where he's like, NEVER ASK ME WHAT I DO WITH YOUR PRESENCE! <laughs> so, we're not gonna quite be done yet, but we're not gonna play through an entire another day. I'm going to start the day tomorrow, I'm gonna turn in my quest, do my school stuff, and we're gonna essentially get to the halfway point of tomorrow. Just to kind of speed this up while not skipping stuff. So, I'll see you in a moment. Oh! Who needs to water their crops? Not me! Which is a weird day for it, considering... This! Yeah. Um... We're gonna take one patch of them. Kane is up to two, and is now up to 159. So, yeah, 17 every level. That's pretty good. I wonder if Kane does more damage, though. Let's check. Nah, that seems the same. Maybe? Maybe it's 10% more. I don't know, it's either the same or 10% more. One of the two. Deal with that. Okay. Now, I needed... What does it say? A fast-growing vegetable that's the same color as cherry blossoms. I want three of them. Now, I'm going to test what happens if I give four instead of three. Those are some delicious pink turnips. Zoom. When it disappeared? Huh? What's a stone tablet? It has some strange writing on it, but for some reason I get a feeling I can read it. Obtain green stone tablet fragment. Yeah, it ate my other one, too. So, be careful of that. Good to know. Now what's on this screen? Oh, right, these ones. Okay, what does this say? There's a bright, fiery red fruit that grows in the trees of Trias Forest. Bring me 12 of them. A red fruit? That must be in... Okay, so I need 12 apples. 
Apple, Morgan, Apple! I, you know, uh, give me a moment. I have five on me. I don't think I have any at home. And we just picked some. So, give me a moment. How dare you. You weren't supposed to destroy it. Kane will be the bane of my existence for a while. Oh, and while we're here and she's here, I want a bargain. Welcome, come in. Today I've got the cooking equipment for sale. Have a look around. You don't have a large kitchen, you should buy that first. Welcome. Yeah, you can't buy it the first week because you can't buy it that first day. You don't have a small kitchen. Yeah, so we can't do that, and that's fine. I should have a weapon of some kind. The weapon being Kane. I wonder if Kane would be considered a citizen of Alvarna. I was really hoping to get some drops here, as, you know, my luck is pretty stupid good with those. It seems that this isn't going to happen. At least... Oh, and there's two in a row. No. No, 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 no. Uh... There we go. I have five there. Eight. I have eight currently. What? Do not focus on the spawner. Ah. Weird. Rolling around at the speed of sound. Got no place to go, got to follow my apples. Okay. So back to what I was doing before. Five apples. I need a total of 12, I don't have enough yet. I need a total of 12, I don't have enough. That is a total of nine. I need three more. Run away! We'll try for a little bit longer. Wow, we just got two out of three. There we go. All right. Now, apple one. Apple two. Apple three. It's disappearing. Obtain the green stone tablet fragment. All right. Oh, hey, there's an apple tree on the other side of it, of course. Well, we can double our uh, apples now. Ah. Oh, more. Triple. I forgot there's multiple app. Wow, okay, this is all very far back in my memory. Then down here, new kind of orc archers as well. I wonder how much experience these guys give. Decent amount, I'm almost at, I'm like 40%. Now let's run up here. Oh, work ambush. Oh, another one. What does it say? Go to Trieste Forest Mushroom Patch and defeat four Tricky Mushroom. They come out around sunset. Tricky Mushrooms? Interesting. I suppose we could take care of that later. Arya, I give you these in recognition of your strength. 
The syrup will make anyone like you instantly. A recipe for friendly syrup. Taste the magic of falling in love. A recipe for Cupid's kiss. Better flavor and more volume. A recipe for pet food. Wow, I learned some new recipes. Obtain the greenstone tablet for... Was that for beating the boss? I'm gonna say that's probably for beating the boss. Uh, future Gabe, confirm or deny. <laughs> Alright, now to move on. Or it was just for getting there. I'm not sure. We'll do this later. We'll come back to this. <laughs> we need to make it to school in time. And, you know, turn in the quest and other stuff like that. Guys, I forgot about Barrett's birthday yesterday. I gave him a single piece of iron and cold that good, apparently. Ah, I, I'm a fool! I knew I'd forgotten something. I was just checking because I realized I'd forgotten. I forgot Barrett's birthday present. I'm a bad friend. Slash student, slash whatever. Welcome back. Glad to see you safe and sound. I knew it. You've got potential. Real potential. Here's your reward. 500G. And so, here you go. Battle hit number two. If you build a forge, you can make your own weapons. You need to talk to the mayor about building a workshop at your school first, though. There are a lot of weapons that can only be obtained by making them yourself. If you gathered them enough materials, then try making one. I can't wait to see the kind of weapons you'll make at your forge. And... Why is my FPS so high? My FPS went to 144? I guess I actually hit space or something, but even then, that was really fast. So, by beating the first boss, we've unlocked another tier of weapon. So, for the short swords, the Defender, a sword created to be used with a shield, greatly improves chance of avoiding incoming attacks. So, yeah, just, you know, over double what we'd been doing previously. Uh, that's actually it? Oh. Well, I guess we unlocked the bronze bracelet, which is just a better bracelet. Uh, the talisman, a, ta a charm that protects the bearer from harm. Field gloves, protects your hands from blisters and calluses. No farmer should be without a pair. And that seems to be all the new stuff. Awesome. We won't be getting any of it because I want to make everything myself, but I will eventually pick up a couple weapons and start forging them. Oh, it seems we missed the morning classes. I thought they lasted until noon, but Mana just left at 11.20. Dang it. We missed the morning classes. Well, uh, rather than do the morning classes, we learned the secret of giving stone tablets gifts, I guess. I don't know, something like that. Guys, next time on Let's Play Rune Factor 2, A Fantasy Harvest Moon. We'll be taking care of that one stone tablet that's in the Trieste Forest and probably exploring that shrine thing. I figured that would be pretty fun. See you all, guys, next... I see you all next time, and I hope you have a fantastic day. Goodbye.